go through this arch and it's suddenly there and it looks really dramatic. It's really, really cool. Check out that view. So it's like two hours late or something. The hotel do a shuttle so we can actually get to the airport, which is awesome. We now have our hair cut, don't we, Zing? And we're gonna hit the road. First stop is gonna be Pisa. So a bit of time has passed since I turned the camera on. I was all full of, oh, the hire car, we're just going to Pisa. We're gonna do that, but we had a slight glitch in that when we were en route, a toll came up. Now, normally with hire cars, they kind of tell you about tolls. We didn't get any kind of warning about tolls here at all. And we went into the wrong lane of the toll. It was one of the automatic ones where if you prepaid, you get to go through. Couldn't reverse because there was a car up my butt. Because in Italy, there's a lot of butt surfing that goes on, let me tell you that. But anyway, I couldn't reverse, so I had to drive through. When we went to the next place, we weren't allowed out. And then we got what looked like a fine of 50 euro. So I was like, oh my God, we're both like stressed. Pulled up to the service station to get have a break and then found a police officer who spoke a bit of English and told us to go to a place called Punta Blue, which if you have any questions regarding tolls or you need any to pay for any tolls, that's a good place to go. So he actually canceled our fine. It was a 50 pound fine. Corrected to the actual price, which was 80 cents, which is a big difference. So now we take this to the next toll, put it in and then pay by card and hopefully we won't have any more problems. Ah! I thought I'd fire some random facts at you guys so you know a little bit more because I knew nothing about it. So the Lean Tower of Pisa is a freestanding bell tower. There are seven bells, each representing notes of the major scale, which is kind of quirky. It took 344 years to build the Lean Tower of Pisa. One of the reasons for this is because they had to stop during construction twice because of war. And one of those wars actually lasted 100 years, so that's why it took so long to build. It weighs 14,500 tonnes, which if you think about it, is a ridiculous amount of weight when it's leaning like that. Now it wasn't obviously always leaning, it started to lean in 1178 and it has been gradually leaning more and more ever since. I really like it here, I think it's really worth the visit. You cannot be in this area and not check out the Lean Tower Pisa, it's so iconic. We're not going to bother going up the tower today but we're just going to enjoy the view of it. So we'll see you guys a bit later on. selfies of the tower and to be fair we've done quite a few as well. So we're gonna go and chill somewhere and have a nice cold drink. Hopefully me and Tig won't be leaning when we walk back to the bus, right? It's like a more like an ale than a beer, but I can deal with it. <laughs> cold refreshing so why not? Hi! See you when we get to our next spot. I've 
taken him away here for his birthday. It was like a surprise, the whole thing. So we're in Florence now. So this is our apartment in Florence. I just thought I'd show you guys. There's the kitchen. Look at it, isn't it funky? And there's Florence out the window. I'm gonna explore this properly tomorrow. So there we're going to be munching our breakfast. This is the bedroom. Which is quite nice. Naked lady. Television, sofa with our junk on it. And the bathroom. We've already done our shopping at the supermarket so we're super organised. And hopefully we've got a charger. Tig, have we got a charger? I have a charger. Yay! When I went to Italy years ago, and when I went here, a European adapter would work. I used to be used to Italy being using a plug like this, a two-pin two pin plug, you know? But now, they use this, three-pin plug. Put the two-pin one in, it doesn't actually trigger the electricity, it won't work. But yeah, we've got an oven, so we can have our pizza that we bought, we bought a gluten-free one. I'm gonna turn off the camera, so I'm just gonna let you guys know what I think of this gluten-free pizza. Thank you.